So my two-step finally came in the mail. It's late, I'm in the garage, it's dark, I have one lamp for basically all my light needs. It's super awesome, but I can't wait. I just want to install it. I got it right here, super, super stoked. I'm about to uh, start the install now. It should only take me like 20, 30 minutes, depending on how the wiring goes. So I figure, you know, I might as well just get right into it. All right, so pretty simple. Just got it from Jegs. It's about 267, 270 uh, for the LS1, LS6. Super simple, just plugs into your coil packs. Uh, there's a lot of videos about this out there. It's uh, a really, really easy install, um, so it shouldn't be too rough. All right, all right. Let's see what we're working with. So basically, as you can see, these connectors here are going to go in between these connectors here. It's really simple. Just unplug these like so. There's one on the other side. We'll walk over and grab that right now. Mark it out. Plastic's old, so I need to be kind of gentle with it. All right, so this is really the easy part of the install. Um, there's going to be a short wire with the plugs on it and a long wire. So those go to each side of the engine, whichever, you know, fits. So you really just basically take the connectors, of which there are two, and male to female on both of them. Click them both in. And we're going to go over, do it on the other side, just like so. The other side clicked in, just like that. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. There you go, get it clicked in. Perfect. And so this basically just intercepts the signal to spark and sends it through the unit over there to be able to control basically when the car is sparking. So you can tell it to cut the spark at a certain RPM, giving you different kinds of like rev limiters and launch controls. All right, so now I'm trying to figure out the clutch engagement wire so this is kind of like when you push the clutch in that's when it tells the car to activate like the launch control um so to do that i have to connect the wire off of the msd little uh unit to the clutch sensor back here uh but to get the wire through i've basically jammed a screwdriver through the hood release um cable hole sort of thing uh, and then tried to tape the um, MSD clutch sensor wire um, to that screwdriver, and I'm going to attempt to just yank it through and hope that it stays stuck. Alrighty, the wire's all spliced in. Now I just gotta figure out tucking it. Uh, I ended up struggling to get it through there with the screwdriver, so I just said, uh, not worth it. I'm just gonna go tuck it in along the side here, run it through the uh, the door jam up through this trim into the engine bay and have it hooked up right around here somewhere. So figuring that out right now. All right, so I kind of just have it sitting right here um, next to the clutch fluid reservoir and then ran this cable here along the body panel right inside. Secured here, secured here. This is very temporary. I just kind of want to test things out. And then up to the clutch switch there. But it should be ready to go.